Is your browser redirecting you to the Bing search engine? In this video, you will see how to remove the Bing redirect virus from your PC. Before we start this guide, press the like button and subscribe to our channel in case you forget later. What is the Bing redirect virus? Technically, the Bing redirect virus is not a virus. Bing is a genuine search engine that cybercriminals use to their advantage. They use the Bing search engine to steal the personal information of users. They hijack the browser and replace the search engine, default home page, and new tab settings with their URL. So when a user searches anything on their URL, they record the search query and then redirect the user to the Bing search engine for the result. They record your IP address, geolocation, browsing history, and some hardware software information in search queries. All this collected information is sold to third-party clients and used to display targeted ads on your PCs. The collected data could also be used for identity theft, so you should immediately remove the Bing redirect virus. The browser hijacker responsible for the Bing redirect virus usually enters your PC with potentially unwanted applications. You might have installed a free software that looks legitimate and useful, but it was bundled with the browser hijacker, so we will have to check for PUP infection. How to remove the Bing redirect virus? Uninstall suspicious apps. There might be a suspicious application causing the redirect. Click on Start and type Control Panel. Click on it to open. Now click on Uninstall a program under the Programs category. You will see the list of all installed programs on your PC. Now carefully observe every program and remove the suspicious ones. You should uninstall the programs that you don't use or don't remember installing. To remove them, select the program and click on Uninstall Change button, then follow the instructions to remove it. Remove Suspicious Chrome Extensions In this step, you need to remove the suspicious extensions from the Chrome. Open Menu. Hover the mouse over More Tools. Now click on Extensions. Now you will see the list of all extensions on a new page. Now, carefully observe each extension and remove the ones that you don't need or don't remember installing. To remove them, click Remove button and then confirm your action. Reset your browser. If you reset your browser, all the modified settings and installed extensions get deleted. On Google Chrome, open Settings. Here on the left side, click on Advanced. Then click on Reset and Clean Up. Then click on Restore Settings to their original defaults. Now click on Reset Settings. To reset Microsoft Edge, open Settings. From the left side, click on Reset Settings. Then click on Restore Settings to their default values. Now confirm your action. Check the host file. The redirect virus could also modify the host file on your system, making it more challenging to remove. To check your host file, click on Start, type Notepad. Right-click on it, then select Run as Administrator. Click Yes if prompted. Now click on the File menu and select Open. Now select all files here. Then browse your system drive, Windows, System32, Drivers, and then ETC. Here you will see the host file. Select it and then click on Open. You need to ensure that it doesn't have anything after this line that you didn't add. If there is something, you need to delete that. Now click on File and Save. Scan with Malware Fox Anti Malware. Browser hijackers are stubborn. They hide in your system and don't go easily. You need to scan your PC with Malwarefox Anti-Malware. It will scan your PC deeply and find browser hijackers, unwanted extensions, adware, spyware, and trojans. Download and install it from the link in the description. Run the scan. Then remove the detected threats. That's it for this video. If it does help you, press the like button and share the video with your friends.
we keep uploading videos related to computer security, so subscribe to our channel and press the bell button to make sure you don't miss anything.